the Holy Spirit is the third person of the Holy Trinity. This means the Holy Spirit is God, co-equal with God the Father and God the Son, and is of the same essence. God the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit are distinct from one another in terms of their personal relationship. But they are co-equally God, meaning they are all the being of God. In other words, they do not exist independently one from the other. So, you cannot remove one of the three persons of God and still have God as revealed in the Bible. As the third member of the Trinity, the Holy Spirit is a person and is also personal. There are a number of references that point to the Holy Spirit's divine characteristics in the Bible, but that will be a topic for another day. Today, we'll talk about the graces the Holy Spirit imparts in us. 1. The Holy Spirit illuminates our understanding of scriptures. If the Holy Spirit does not send a ray of divine light into our heart, the words we read or hear avail little. 2. The Holy Spirit sanctifies our affections. Through the Holy Spirit, we obtain the forgiveness of our sins. Through Him, we are purified from all stains of venial sins. Through His gifts, those who surrender themselves to His divine grace become angels. Not that they change their nature, but what is still more wonderful, they remain men walking before God as pure and holy as angels. Through the grace of the Holy Spirit, man, who before was steeped in the mirror of sin, now shines more brilliantly than the sun. 3. The Holy Spirit strengthens the will. According to the words of our Savior, but you shall receive the power of the Holy Spirit coming upon you, and you shall be witness unto me. St. Bernard says, Through the gifts of the Holy Spirit, man is fortified against every temptation and persecution. He becomes unconquerable and fearless. Sure, the Holy Spirit consoles the faithful of the earth in their trials, difficulties, and sufferings. Therefore, our Lord called him the Counselor. 5. The Holy Spirit purifies our body, and by his divine indwelling in our souls, he makes us his temples. The Holy Spirit elevates his mind and raises it high. Why were the saints so detached from earth? Because they led themselves to be led by the Holy Spirit. Those who are led by the Holy Spirit have true desires. That is the reason why so many ignorant people are wiser than they learned. The Holy Spirit is our strength and our light. He teaches us to distinguish between truth and falsehood, between good and evil. God bless you.